chicken steak today. Oh, crrr. I'm doing some steak and potatoes and broccoli. Something so, 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 so simple. Something so easy. Um, 30 minute meal at the most. Y'all will see how simple and easy this little meal is and it's gonna be delicious. Anyway guys, um, let me show y'all what we got here. So, I got some steak. I got some steak. I got some broccoli the easy way and I'm gonna put a little cheese on it. I got my sausage that I'm gonna fry and put in with my potatoes. Oh, I got a little bit of olive oil, onion powder, garlic powder, salt, pepper, Creole season, and of course I am about to pull out my onions and green onions because we need those for these potatoes. Oh, All right guys, so Y'all ready? All right, my loves, my angels. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn up the, the fire on this pot. Now guys, this is a cast iron skillet. So a lot of times we want the cast iron skillet to go ahead and heat up and get hot a little bit before we start cooking it. And then I'm gonna go ahead to part two. Y'all stay tuned. So guys, I, got, I put a little um, olive oil in this uh, cast iron skillet right here and giving it a little bit of time to get hot. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go ahead and pour my potatoes in here. Okay. Go ahead and pour my sausage in here. We got a little onion powder. We're gonna do a little bit of garlic powder. Uh, I'm gonna do a little bit of pepper. And a little bit of salt. That is salt, guys. In the Corona bottle. In the Corona bottle. <laughs> and I'm going to do a little bit of Creole seasoning. All right, y'all ready for this? We're going to do that. I'm going to put a little onion in here. And I'm going to do half of my green onion because I like green onion at the end too give us a little taste you want to let me see it Look, guys, it's good. Look good. Yeah. All right. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put this top on here, so the potatoes can kind of get soft and be on point. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started on my steak. Well, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and let this sit for about 10 minutes because I want it nice and soft. So then when I do my steak, my steak and my potatoes will kind of get done at the same time. Let me get my other glove. I'm going to be picking up on steak and stuff. Where is it? Oh, here it is. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and turn the stove on. This right here is going to be for our steak. And, um... Mmm. All right. So once this gets a little warm, again, I am using some olive oil. And uh, I know it looked like I put a lot in that pot, but I did not. It's just that the potatoes and the onions and everything starts to make it make it own its own juice. Um, I did just lace a little bit at the bottom just to keep it from sticking. If y'all wanna 
let's check this out and see how it's doing. This pot is a little hot. All right, y'all come see. Baby, come. Let's see what our potatoes looking like. Here we go. Now look at that. How that look? So smell good. Oh. <laughs> it looks good too. Yes. And normally I like to do manda sausage, but today Janae was wasn't feeling the manda sausage, so we got a little beef sausage here, which is still really good. Now what I'm going to do is, let's see if these potatoes soft. Look at that guys. Just went straight on through. <laughs> the potatoes are soft. So, what I'm going to do now is, and like I said, this was just a little bit of olive oil just to lace the bottom of this pan. It just makes its own juice. So I'm going to go ahead, since it's almost done and now we got that getting hot, and go ahead and put the rest of my green onions on here because... Y'all know your girl like a green onion. Come check it out. Now, I'm gonna let this sit. It's already been 10 minutes. I'm gonna let this sit for probably like another five minutes, and then I'm gonna turn. I'm gonna turn it off, but leave the top on so it can just still uh, get nice, and all the seasons can sink in while our steak is getting done. Let's put that there. Make sure everything is nice and clean while we're cooking. All right, guys. Y'all ready to get this steak pop, lock, and dropping? <laughs> we're going to go ahead and put a little olive oil on here. I'm going to smooth this around. Because I don't want to put it too much to make it fry. Y'all see that? The bottom is laced with a little olive oil. Now, the steak right here, this is salt, pepper, onion powder, and garlic powder. Let's see. Excuse me, guys. All right. There we go. We're going to do about five minutes on one side. We're going to flip it over. And we're going to, well, let's say four or five minutes on one side, give or take, depending on how you like your steak. Then like four or five minutes on the other side. Y'all stay tuned. I am going to go ahead and put a little butter. We can actually put this in the microwave, but I want to put a little butter in it. Um, I'm going to turn this on. Uh-oh. Turn that on back there. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, hold up. <laughs> Look, butter. Oh, damn. I hope the butter didn't have it in there. on here now I have turned off the fire on this right here so we're gonna go ahead and turn off the fire and just let that cook and see what we got going on over in the meantime in between time we're gonna flip these steaks baby look at that How that look, guys? Great. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, depending on how long you want to cook, we do ours like four to five minutes on each side. 
This broccoli is already pre is already pretty much we could have put in the microwave. So in about three minutes, that's gonna be done. Here we go. Let's go ahead and check on our potatoes again. Let me do it. Mm, yummy, 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 yummy. Then they got on her chuck. <laughs> Y'all, this is straight from work. Mm -hmm. Put on my Cindy's Chronicle shirt and came in the kitchen. Open up. Boom. All right, guys. <laughs> now, make sure y'all do only like five minutes more on this because, uh, yeah, I kind of overcooked it a little bit. But. <laughs> All right, guys, this here is the finished product. Janae likes yellow cheese, so she got her sausage. As you can see, I kind of burnt them a little bit, but it's okay. She likes her sausage burnt, and me too. I like white cheese, so I got my steak, my potatoes. All right, Janae, so I got my broccoli, my white cheese, my steak and potatoes. Janae got her broccoli, her steak and potatoes, and her, I mean her potatoes and her <laughs> sausage. I'm all over the place. All right, Nate, come taste it and tell me what you think. I have one right, oh, you got it. Let's see. Yeah, I can't see the plate. There you go. Uh, steak taste. Very good. Very good. Yeah. But let's see what that. Uh, this steak is good. <clears throat> it is. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Let's see what those potatoes hitting for. Alright, chew this up. Mm. Mm. A little fat. Mmm. Potatoes taste good. Tastes good? Yeah. Alright guys, well that's it for the steak, potatoes, and broccoli. We about to chow down. Alright, Nay. <laughs> and, and thank you guys for watching and have an amazing day. <laughs> <laughs>